<clears throat> hey. I'm back. Okay, so I've just finished filming the end of the last video, hence the same outfit. But let's just try to get over that, okay? Okay. I'm going to start with this page. And this is the first page in the book that has instructions. Most people do this, like, right away. But... I don't know, I've just waited a really long time to do this one. So this is just the name page. I'm not going to read every single instruction, um, but it just asks you to write your name in a bunch of different ways, allegedly, in tiny letters, backward, all kinds of stuff. So I'm going to do that now and decorate it as well. this page with circles. So yeah, that's what I'm doing next. And this page, do a really ugly drawing. Use ugly subject matter. Gum, poo, dead things, a badly drawn bird, mold, barf, crud. In this page 62, pretend you are doodling on the back of an envelope while on the phone. My paper chain is sticking out. And it gives you a picture of an envelope. So, I don't really talk on the phone that often. I don't know about you, but I don't. And when I do, they're usually pretty quick conversations. I don't like spend hours on the phone. So, plus I wanted to do this on camera and not just like randomly when I get a phone call. So I'm not going to be talking on the phone while I do this, I'm just going to do it. Create a non-stop line. And it gives you a little start bubble. No finish because it's non-stop. So yeah, let's do that.
and 188 collect the collect collect the letter W here um, and I did this one in my last breakfast journal and it was ugly because when you put W's all over the page it looks like fur or something it's just ugly so I'm gonna try to figure out like a prettier way to do this page because oh why the letter W? That's like the ugliest letter ever. Anyway, enough said. I'm going to do it now. pages that I'm gonna do so let me just go through and talk about each page a little bit this page is the name page and I put little bows in the background because I wanted there to be some color in the background so that when I did my name in white you could actually see it that was literally the only reason that I did that um, but yeah so I did bows and I did them with watercolor and then I kind of like outlined them with pencil um, and then on this side I drew a chow chow puppy because I really like chow chow puppies. I don't have one. I don't know anybody who has one, but I wish I did because they're really cute. And then I put a green and blue background. And then obviously I didn't put my real address or phone number because I knew that this was going on the internet and that wouldn't be smart. And then this black border around both of the pages. And yeah, it's a so-so page. I, I don't know. I like it sometimes and sometimes I don't, but you know. It's there, so. This page, I did not do anything like super creative or spectacular. I just kind of followed the instructions. I wanted to do something basic and just repetitive and simple, so that's what I did. I just drew tons and tons of little circles. And I used my gel pens, which I got a big thing of gel pens for Christmas, and they're like awesome. But yeah, no special designing or anything like that. Just. Circles. This page, um, I did really ugly stuff like a toilet and a spider throwing up and then I just colored it all rainbow or parts of it rainbow and then I wrote rainbows make everything better in the middle because <clears throat> even though it is really disgusting it still looks kind of cool because I colored it with rainbow so that was the concept behind that. And this page, which I really like this page a lot. Um, I actually, I wasn't planning on doing this while on the phone, but like this whole area, I was actually on the phone. <laughs> it was weird. Uh, I got a phone call, so I was talking on the phone while doing it, but most of it I was doing just not on the phone. Um, so yeah, I did some cupcakes in pen, and obviously watercolor the background first. And then I just did this like, I don't know, just like random patterns and pen all over the envelope with a watercolor background. So yeah, pretty random, but I really like how this turned out. And then this page, and I actually went through a couple different ideas first before doing this one. I couldn't figure out what I wanted to do, and I drew some things in pencil and didn't like them, so I just started over. Um, but this was the idea that I settled on. It's just like vines and leaves and then flowers in the um, empty spaces. It came out a lot more, I don't know, like chaotic than I pictured it, but I don't know. I kind of like it like that. And this is all um, pen and marker. Yeah, like I said, I don't like how it looks to have just a bunch of W's on the page. So I tried to do something kind of different. I just drew objects that started with 
W, so like Winnie the Pooh, Whistle, Watering Can, uh, Wagon, Watch, Wax, just, you, you know, you know. Okay, so that's really all I have for you now. Um, I don't know if I've told you something different recently, but I just recounted the pages that I have left in this, and there are only four episodes left for this series um, until the final flip through. So it is coming to an end, but I will be starting my new series pretty soon, um, and I'm pretty sure there will be a little bit of overlap between the two. If you don't know what new series I'm talking about, uh, I've been updating in the description for the past couple of episodes about that, so if you want to read about it, you can. I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time talking about it right now, but you will find out soon enough. So I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye!